Hey, what's up, YouTube? All right, so I'm sitting here waiting for a student to finish her driving test. Early Saturday morning, you know, we do the third party driving test. So my student is actually currently testing. So I decided I'd just make a, a quick little video. In this video, I'm gonna talk about the, the, the different ohms. I'm sure anyone that knows about sound system knows about the, the, the ohms law, as you say. You know, the different variation of ohms. You have the four ohms, eight ohms, two ohms. Uh, most amplifiers will tell you they will drop down to, to two ohms. For the, the, the good amplifiers will go down to two. Some, some go as low as one ohm. But typically we play between four and eight. Eight, four, and two, some, depending on the power amplifiers. On my system, I, I've been using four ohms on everything. Four ohms and bass, four ohms and mid bass, four, ohm, four ohms on high mids. But lately I'm getting bigger, more powerful amplifiers. So I am going to be dropping down to two ohms on a few of the, the, the frequencies. Like for instance, um, I have double 18s and I have single 18s. I have double 12s on the, on the high mids and I have single 15s on the low mids or mid bass. Now, um, on the single 15s, which is the mid bass, if you have one of them hooked up, that would be eight homes. That is considering that we're using eight home speaker. Um, we can do four ohm speaker, but that's typically what they use in, in cars and whatnot, in you know, car audio. So for pro audio, it's mostly eight ohm speaker. So on the 15, if you have one 15, that's eight ohms. If you put two 15s connected in parallel, like you plug one box to the other, that's four ohms. So that's how I typically play it. Now, Due to the fact that the amplifiers that, I, that I'm using now are so much more powerful, I'm going to try each one of these frequencies into two ohms. Two ohms would be four of those 15s connected together. You get what I'm saying? So you will have two speakers is four ohms, four speakers, four speakers is two ohms. So we're gonna, I'm gonna be playing the mid bass into two ohms and I have the double twelves I'm gonna connect two of them together to bring that down to two ohms. So I'm gonna play two ohms all, all the way across the board. On the eighteens again I have two single I have four the double eighteens and eight single eighteen. So the double eighteens you're gonna play two of them on one side of an amplifier would be two ohms and two on the other side would be two ohms. So I'm gonna do that on the doubles and on the single 18s, I'm gonna play four on each side of the amp. So I bought two, two amplifiers that plays like 12,000 watts per channel. So for each 12,000 watt, I'm gonna have four speakers on each side. So four speakers, two ohms on each side. Again, one speaker is eight ohms, two speakers are four ohms, four speakers per side is two ohms. So, you know, in case you're thinking about building a sound system and, and you're confused about the different ohms, you know, if you have two speakers connected in parallel, that's four ohms. Four speakers, speakers connected in parallel, that's two ohms. And most sound systems are playing two or four. Very rarely do you find a sound system, a big system that plays eight ohms. That's just one speaker per side. Most, speak, most people are using at least two speakers per side, at least four ohms. Um, so if you're using the standard size amplifiers, it's probably gonna be four ohms. That's what I was using before. The amplifiers were powerful enough to play two speakers per side and play them in a relatively efficient. So now that this, the amplifiers are much bigger, because like, uh, for instance, I'm gonna be using my CVR3302 on the mid bass. 
So those are quite powerful. So I'm gonna be playing, you know, playing them into two ohms. I'm gonna play four speakers per side on those amplifiers. I'm gonna use two of those amplifiers to play my mid bass. On the high mids, I'm gonna be using the 3304. That is the 3300302 times four. So there's a four channel 3004. So that's what I'm gonna be using on, on high mid. So each one of the, each side will have two of the double twelves. So again, one speaker is eight ohms, two speakers are four ohms, four speakers connected in parallel is two ohms. So I hope that helps, but that's typically how it's done and that's how I'm, my system is set up. So yeah, I hope this helps and like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit the notification bell. Tell your friend to tell a friend. See? Uh, thanks for watching and I will see you on the next video. Disappointed sound